Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, welcome back to another episode of The 900, and you'll see we are on the title screen. The episode I was just recording, episode number 14, um, we had a power outage in our house as I was playing, and I don't have a UPS on my computer. So, yeah, it went down, and now whenever I try to reload the game, it just crashes to the desktop. And since I was playing in Iron Man, I don't have any other saves. Hooray for that. So, yeah, um, debating about this, I think I'm just going to start a new career. I'll continue on with the 900, but I'll start over. We'll continue at episode 14, just call it 14.1, and then we'll just continue on with new episode numbers after that, and I'll start over. Um, I want to change, uh, let's go to a new career here. I want to change some of the stats, I think. Um, I'm not finding... Battletech Flashpoint to be all that exciting at the moment. I mean, we, we haven't got into Flashpoints and things like that yet. I understand that. Um, but I find it very slow going. So I want to change it slightly. We had our pieces set to three. We had everything set to standard here the last time we went. Uh, except for Mech Warrior Progression, which we had set to slow, which I'm going to do again. Um, I think I might... Yeah, we'll leave it on slow. Um, leave everything else exactly as it is. Uh, but parts for Mech Assembly, I'm going to crank this up to eight. And then I'm just going to allow myself to choose mech parts. Um, I mean, we had a lot of mechs at the point where we crashed. We, we had um, our Vindicator plus four Panthers in our mech um, bay. And then in storage, we had like Spider, a couple of Locusts, Firestarter, a few others. So we were doing okay. But I mean, in salvage, there really isn't a whole lot to choose other than mech parts. Uh, you know, I could, there's only so many LRM-10s and AC-5s and medium lasers you can take uh, at low level. So I know that'll change later on. But we're going to choose eight parts for mech assembly. And leave everything as it is like this. Um, and we're going to start the game. And I'm just going to speed forward. I'm going to go through ways I set myself up before. Uh, and when I come back, we'll have be back in the Argo with... Same colors, same name, same everything. Okay, we're here. So, yeah, I got the colors back up and running. Mech Bay is the same. Um, the only difference is I couldn't remember exactly the specs um, that we started off with. So we ended up on Independence here. Uh, a little bit farther away from where we normally started off at Larden before. Um, and we were over at Panzer. So we're kind of out in the backwaters now. Which I think might be a good thing for the start, but, um, you know, we'll see how it goes. So, we're going to go to the com command center and choose a contract right away. I'm just going to get started. Uh, I started um, getting the power conduits up and running in engineering, so that's good. Um, we're going to choose one man's art for the Torian Concordat. Uh, lots of salvage, but low payout, so it, this is pretty much a simple one. We know what this, we, we know what we have to do with, with this one. We just got to grab stuff from two different locations and get out. So we're going to negotiate this, and we're going to go for full salvage. Uh, pirates aren't going to like us, but too bad. We'll get some rep with them later. So we want to put the Vindicator in. Panther is the fire support. Uh, Jenner, and I think I'm going to go with the Spider. We're going to go all jumpers here. Um, MC900 foot's going to be primary pilot. Uh, we're going to want to put, I think... So we got a whole new set of people here, so i got to figure out where I'm going to put them. Let's put Ripley... Uh, let's put Hellburner because of the name. I think we're going to put them in the Panther. Uh, Ripley's going to go in the Jenner because she's got good piloting. And the Spider needs... Well, yeah, she's got good piloting. And I think you need to have tactics for Spider, so maybe Weasel. Do something like that. And let's deploy. Alright, well this is my second attempt. I might have to install, uh, reinstall Battletech here. So we're going to try one man's art again. Um, let's go full salvage. And, oh, I remembered our guys this time. Okay, good. So, yeah, so we're just going to deploy and get this done. Hopefully we don't crash on the way down again. Hmm. Okay, well, looks like we made it to the surface this time. All right, let's try and pull this mission off. So, looks like we've got a secondary objective here, primary on that side, and then there's our escape point. 
So chances are we're looking at two lances of mechs. Now I don't want to go along here and choose the second target first. I think we're going to go up the hill on this side, crest it, and stay on this side. So at least we're on a level playing field with the enemies coming from here. Now this is going to be half skull mission, so chances are we're not really worried about too much here. As long as we stay in a group and focus fire, we should be fine. Don't think I got my colors 100% correct either. I think I'm out a little bit on what I had from before. All right, Ripley's getting the trees. Got contacts. Okay. Enemy contacts. Actually, can we jump farther than that? No, we cannot. All right. Let's see what they do here. If they are light, they may crest the hill early, in which case we can get some shots at them. Now these might be light um, lances as well. There might not be a full lance here. Yeah, it might be the case. Waiting for orders. Okay, let's get some good evasion going. Okay, we're going to be in the open, but I don't mind that, as long as we have good evasion. So let's get over here, and then we will move up Hellburner into the forest. And 900 foot into the forest as well, if we can get in there. Yep. Okay, cool. So we're ready for the next turn for when they crest. Okay, he's attempting to flank, it looks like. Either that or get, get uh, meet up with the other guys. So we're going to reserve, see what this guy up here does. Going to give him first shot. Okay. It's actually a pretty smart tactic. Yeah, they're meeting to regroup, and that's fine. All right, so let's go with, where's our spider here? Weasel. We should be able to get up and see our first target here. So let's get up into the trees. Um, I don't want to go too close. I guess this is probably going to be fine. Hopefully we get a back shot out of this. See what, see what we get here. We do. Commander 1B. Fire straight into this guy's back. 50% chance to hit. Yeah, not bad. Okay, so there's four more chevrons over there. So Ripley... Let's get up here. We're going to go into the woods for sure. Putting everything in this guy's back. We're going to be really overheated here, but I want to try and get a quick kill. There's the right torso. Sure has. Alright, now Hellburner is not going to be able to get up to get this guy. But we can target a new guy. I'm thinking that's probably what we want to do. Roger. Get the first shots on these guys if we can. So I'm going to leave the SRM-4 off. It's only got a 10% chance to hit, but we will fire the PPC. Nice. That hit something good. I want to try and get some early damage in here. So if we jump, I'm going to jump up to this trees here. So we're going to move into here. Don't have multi-target yet, or I said fire the LRMs at this guy, but we're going to target him. This is a Locust 1M, but we're going to target the Jenner. Jenner's the obvious threat. Ah. So they got five lights, looks like. Let's see what the Locust does. We're going to get our Jenner moving next. I want to try and finish this guy off. Let's try and finish the commando off. Receiving. Ripley, let's get you here maybe? Looks like a good chance to hit. We're only going to be able to fire a couple of things. Leave the SRM-4 off. Have to leave two mediums. We're going to fire two mediums straight in this guy's back. Okay, we got one hit. There goes the other arm. So he's a stick now. Cool. He's a headbutting stick is what he is. 
No, 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 no. You want to play a back game? We can play a back game. All right. So, Weasel. Actually, you know what? Let's hold off. What's up, boss? I want to get Hellburner going again. Let's get you up here into the trees. Kind of facing this way, I think. Something like that. Because I want to use you to fire on this guy again. So there's another Jenner back here, Jenner D. So we're going to fire on this guy. Um, let's go with the SRM4s as well. Damn. Look at them all. Jeez. We'll go fishing afterwards, pick up those fish. Okay, a little bit of damage. A couple of planks here or there. Alright, let's move Weasel up. Down to... Here. Going to get around behind this guy, shoot him in the back again. Firing. We can't have a stick headbutting us in the rear. Oh, two misses. Really? Yeah, he's got half his weapons. He can still be dangerous. Damage is light. And a spider, okay. Not too worried. Panther's gonna go first for us next turn. Uh, we're gonna jump back here. Get a little bit of evasion. And hopefully finish this guy up. Leave the PPC off, get some heat back. Uh, we're gonna leave the LRM off as well. Just fire the medium and the small. Oh, come on. Yep. Headbutt attack. Here it comes. Nope. It's a locust. Still a headbutt attack, though. Okay, let's see if we can get rid of... Yes, Commander. Let's move into here. Copy that. Just stopping myself from jumping because I want to save some heat. So we're going to fire on this guy with three mediums. Hopefully we can kill him now. On rear armor. There we go. Finally. One less headbutt. That's a kill. That is a kill. Okay, Jenner moving around. Yeah, I saw that coming. It's okay though, we're moving the panther here in a second. I'm taking heavy hits, Commander. Yep, you're moving. Don't worry. Waiting for orders. Can we get to a point where we can see this other nah? Fifty-five percent chance with the PPC. And maybe we regroup. Forty percent chance in the back of that guy. Fifty-five on this guy. What if I do? Something more along this line. Got it. I know we're going to use up a lot of heat there, but can't use the SRM-4. Actually, we can't use the PPC, but we can put the SRM-4 into the side of this guy. Target confirmed. Why well, I keep tr trying to target the weak guys? Get them out of the way as fast as possible. Yeah. Spider still has to go, too. Oh, oh sorry. Weasel's got to go still. That's our spider. Okay, so let's move back here. Just going to run it back. Once again, saving heat. Going to put some uh, mediums in the back of this guy. 
right leg, right torso, right arm. He's going down. Target's taking a critical hit. Sure has. So we're going to jump back with our main guy into the water. Here comes the melee attack. I figured he'd do something like that. It's not a lot of damage from a spider, so... Kind of... Oh, unsteady, really. Alright. Well, you're moving first next turn, so... Let's jump back to the edge of the map board. And we're going to target this guy on the ground. Let's not even hold back. Let's fire everything for the CT. Engaging target. There we go. Alright, scratch another target. Two down. Which one is this? This is the full strength Jenner. Okay. That's an interesting play. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Receiving. Confirmed. We're going to do this. And we're going to put both of these into the back of this guy. Okay, he took a hit, but where did he take the hit, though? Oh, here comes the melee attack. Yep. Yeah. Turning your back to the rest of my guys is not a good idea. But that's okay. So where do you take the hit here? See, he's already got four points left in the CT back. So let's get this spider going. Um, they got the lowest evasion. How far can we go here with the jump? Pretty darn far. We're going to come around here. We're going to hopefully claim our next victim. Going to have to just fire one, I guess can't fire any. Uh, should we take the overheat? Let's do it. Damn. Shouldn't have taken the chance. That didn't hit? No, it didn't. My heat sink can't vent fast enough. Yeah. I'm taking damage. Comes another spider. Turn it into brawl bots. Don't like this. Uh, oh, it's sprinting. Can't do that. 30%. 50. Hmm. Let's move up here. Panther's on his own for now. I'm going to have to fire on this guy. Uh, let's go this route. Target acquired. I hate spreading the damage out amongst separate targets, but I am kind of overstretched here, unfortunately. Now, it's long range for both these guys. That's not, there's no direct line of sight except for this spider here. Is that direct? That's direct there. 50, 35. What if we, no, I don't want to jump though. It's going to use so much heat and it's not going to really give us that much advantage. So let's move up here. I'm going to target this guy, I'm going to fire everything. Engaging target. Okay, nice PPC hit. Not enough to take the shoulder, but that's good. I think we hit the torso. So, I'm going to want to... Oh, what's he doing? Back shot. No, side shot. I can't take much more of this. Yeah, you're going to have to. Standing by. So, let's get you up here. Relatively cool. Um, so let's fire in the back of this guy. Ah, come on. Oh, we got a head hit on him, though. We must have hit the side, not the back. 
See what he does here. Crawl bots. Nope. My internals are taking a beating. Should have had those tacos for breakfast then. All right, uh, Hellburner. Commander. Forty-five. Don't think we're gonna get a much better chance to hit than that. Still forty-five and forty. Forty-five and twenty-five. Forty, seventy percent. That's the back of that guy. Still forty-five on this. Ah. Let's fire on this guy. I copy. There goes the leg. So the Vindicator should be able to just punish that guy next turn. Or when he's up next turn. So let's get the spider over the hill. We're going to melee with the spider, I think. And if we've got enough movement, we're going to attack this guy in the back. Yeah, he's trying to engage me to stop me from killing this guy. That's what I would do. Okay, Weasel, can we get... We can get on this side, so let's do that. Gotta get our heat down. Ah, 30 points, not bad. Okay. 900 for Jesus. Let's just, uh... I don't want to go too far forward. Let's just jump over here. Get some evasion going. So we're going to do this. I don't want to get to that point where the spider can kind of get around behind me. So let's fire on him. We're going to leave the LRMs off. Uh, what do we got left in the torso here? 10. Hmm. Don't have quite enough to kill him in the center torso. But we can blow this one torso off. Give him another pilot injury. Actually, maybe we should try for a headshot. Mm, let's just go for the torso. All right, that looked like a CT hit to me. Find out here in a second. We're in good positions, I think, overall to take at least these two Jenners out. So yeah, he took a CT hit. So let's get. Uh, we want to push this guy back a turn too, I think, just in case we don't kill him. So, let's go first. This guy's gone. I don't have to worry about him. Spider. Let's take the panther first. And uh, let's move up here. I'm not, gonna, I'm not going to um, jump. I want to save my heat. We're going to fire on this guy and try and finish him up. Here's the right torso. Solid connection on that, one. that was the side we hadn't hit yet. Oh, stop it. Okay, so Weasel, let's get you back. All we need is one hit in this one good hit in this guy's back. Let's get back as far as we can. We should be able to fire both mediums. Yeah, we'll fire them both. Hopefully we hit a CT. Of course not. Why would we why would we ever hit the CT? Let's finish it up, Ripley, please. How many can we fire? Three. Just fire all three in his back. Finally. Then there was two. So Jenner's only got one more HP left. Pilot does, but he's got no armor left. Here comes a melee attack. Really? Please limp over. It's just so sad. Look at him. He's just very sad. 35 damage. Ugh. You have no idea how infuriating this is. I'm playing a game of Brawl Bots here. Ugh. There you go. How you like me now? Enemy mech destroyed. 
see what that spider does. Oh, he committed suicide. Wonderful. All right, let's finish him up. Ready for orders. Let's fire on him. Roger that. Goes the right torso. I don't know if I had a like a quarter for every single time my max hit the opposite side of the mech, order. and the, the enemy max hit the opposite sides of my mech than what they're on, okay. I'd be rich. All right, let's fire. Uh, can we put the SMM for them? No, we can't. Two mediums, fine. Target acquired. Let's get Weasel yep. over here, down to the forest. Should be able to fire them both. Yep. On it. We get the arm? No. Hitting everywhere but where we want to. Not even going to move. Fire everything. Engaging target. There you go. And that's it, folks. Let's go get the stuff and get out of here. Alright, so you're going to sprint this way. You're going to sprint this way. You're going to sprint into here. And you're going to sprint this way. Alright, there's the primary objective. Can you get down there? Nope. It's a race to see who can get there first. Ah, there's the spider. Speedy spider. There we go, folks. Game over. Alright, so not the best 14th episode. Uh, we did take a bit of internal damage. Mostly because of Brawl Bots, but um, once I get these guys laid out how I want them again, uh, I really want to get the uh, the Panther with an LR, uh, LRM-10 and a large laser for a, lar for a long range platform, and then these guys for close range. But let's figure out where we're going to take here. Not a lot of stuff. So we're going to grab two Jenner pieces, and probably the Spider piece only because it's a 30 tenner. Actually, let's grab a medium laser because we don't have any weaponry. I want to add some, start adding some stuff, so we're going to need some of that. So let's confirm this. Yeah, so we got everything with the commando part. Pretty cool. Nice. Let's continue. All right. So I'm going to continue along with uh, this uh, Battletech Flashpoint series again, starting at 14.1, which is what we're at now. Um, and it will run kind of congruently with... Um, my Rogue Tech Cold Forge series, which is at episode 14 right now, I believe. So we'll be doing one episode of each a day. I'm going to try, because this Battletech generally allows for a couple of missions a day, I'm going to try and do two missions per episode with this um, Flashpoint series, continuing along, as long as, like I said, it doesn't crash. Now, I've had, I had trouble getting into this after the initial crash and loss of the game. Restarting, I had trouble getting into the first mission. It crashed out again, so I don't know if I need to reinstall Battletech or not. I guess I'll figure, find out when I... Well, actually, no, I won't find out. I was thinking about I'll find that out when I start playing Rogue Tech, but Rogue Tech's a completely different install, so it should be fine. So I may have to reinstall Battletech, but we'll see what happens. But until next time, you know, if you liked the video, please drop a like. Sorry for having to start over again. Feel free to subscribe and drop a comment down, down below. Uh, but until next time, we'll see you all later.